started because of my passion for health and sustainability, but particularly regarding digestive health. So it, it all started with me messing around with coconuts back in my back garden in England. And um, I played around with coconut milks and coconut yogurts and kefirs. And then I moved on to playing around with coconut flour. And from that, I created uh, tortillas and a lot of the recipes that we use now here in the restaurant. But the restaurant here was a little bit unexpected because we'd started to build the hotel and we didn't really have a plan of the menu or who our chef would be for here. And when it came to building the restaurant, our architects came to us and said, okay, so who's your chef? Can I speak to them? We need the, rest uh, we need the menus so that we can um, start to plan the kitchen. And I said, uh, well, we don't have a chef right now. So give me a couple of weeks and I'll go away. And I started to create menus. And I basically created menus based on what I would like to eat and what I ate and what we eat as a family. And surprisingly, we put the menus up online and uh, from that we actually got bookings because of the menus. So we hadn't even opened the restaurant but we were getting bookings. A lot of people don't have any idea where coconuts come from or where the coconut water that they drink from the bottle actually originates from. So I'm going to give you a little explanation as to the origins and the evolution of a coconut. Coconuts will traditionally grow on palms, which are like the ones hanging above us. And when they're green like this, it means that they're full of water and that's the perfect time to get your coconut water. They have to be chopped off and then cut in a particular way to be able to drink your coconut water straight from it. Or if you open it up completely, you can see that as well as the water, there's still some lovely jelly flesh in there, which you may have had the opportunity to scoop out and taste that. This is really delicious and very nutritious. However, the coconuts that are the most useful and the ones that we use the most are these ones, which are the classic coconuts that everybody knows. And those actually come from the old coconuts that have fallen from the ground. They feel really hollow, but when you open them up, you can see that the skin, the shell has hardened inside. You've got a lot more meat, there's less water. And this meat is perfect for making um, milks, yogurts, cheeses, um, coconut oil, coconut flour. It all comes from this type of coconut. This is the coconut that we love at The Real Coconut. Cheers.